And thanks so much for joining us. Hillsborough County deputies just busting a Chase employee who they say was secretly adding her boyfriend to customers' accounts so they could steal money. New at 6, ABC Action News reporter Clifton French revealing the unexpected accounts they were targeting. Clifton? Yeah, they were targeting health savings accounts. Now, one victim tells me the employee actually had duplicate debit cards made of her account so the thieves could walk right into this Chase Bank and steal from her account. Entrusted with financial information, now deputies say she put the health and safety of her clients at risk. I went to uh, pick up a prescription and you know, when I went to pay for it with my HSA card, it was said that I had a balance of like $2. Carrie Kraus and her husband had their Chase Health Savings account compromised two years ago. They live in Texas. Deputies say 31 year old Tampa call center employee Dakima Williams stole their information. I assume I must have spoken to her, and that's how she got our social security and all of our personal information. Arrest documents say Williams added her 22 year old boyfriend, Darius Lopez, to the account. He made two withdrawals from this Chase location on Fletcher Avenue one for $5,000, the other for $4,000. Security cameras capturing his picture. Williams didn't answer his door when we knocked this morning, but arrest documents say there were more victims. In fact, nine total accounts were compromised. I was frustrated and, you know, just hoping that there would be no problem, you know, for them reimbursing the money that had been stolen. Tonight, Krause says Chase has reimbursed them for every cent. And Chase Bank says they quickly fired that employee and they've added more security measures to keep anything from this happening again. I also think it's important to note that Chase Bank also recently sold their HSA business. I'm reporting live in Tampa tonight. Clifton French, ABC Action News.